Hello everybody and welcome to this week's episode of the Spirit Tragic Expo! We are gonna be doing some things today. Today I think we're gonna go mining because we haven't mined in quite a while and we haven't gotten a new world in a really long time. But I think we're gonna go mining in Yuka because apparently you can get cryo pieces there now. I'm not really 100% positive on that but I think that's where you get cryo pieces. Someone sent me a picture on Twitter and I'm pretty sure it was a cryo portal chest and they were in Yuka. I think that's what it was. I hope it is. But we're going in mining. We're, oh, no, 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 no. We're going mining in Yuka. But before we do that, man, I am like majorly struggling with words already. Look at this. Look at it. Okay, meat. Oh my gosh. After last week's episode, I was um, generating new worlds so that I could get all of the things from the summer update because I had not yet done that. And there was a turkey. I was like... I get, well, I mean, I'll kill it. I'll kill the turkey. Never gotten turkey meat before. I don't know why. I just never have. I've always been so unlucky. Look, it's turkey meat. And I was really excited and I wanted to try cooking something with it. But all the good things need two of them, which is rather disappointing. You can make a few things with only one, but I really wanted to make the stuff like this. Like the perfect turkey. Um... I'd probably make this one, but you need two of them, and we only have one, so that's very disappointing. But I'm definitely holding on to this one, and uh, we will cook with it if I ever get the second one. And if we don't, we will definitely cook something with it before the end of the season. Oh, because, yes, because, yes. Um, and But another thing that I want to talk about real quick before we start our mining is that I really want to redo my armor and so I've kind of got it all planned out. So I found this a while ago, like a couple couple weeks, couple episodes ago. And uh, so this does 25% fall resistance, which if I put this on now, it will make me completely resistant to fall damage, which is cool, but I will be down two hearts, which it's kind of like, do I want to be resistant to fall damage or do I want to have more hearts? But I figured it out so that I can still have these plus two hearts and I can also be resistant to fall. Someone just sent me a notification to play a Facebook game with them. No, thank you. What was I talking about? Um, my solution for the two heart thing. Um, I want to get a cyan turtle chest because this gives you three hearts. It will also give us a 10% boost to our fall damage. Oh, wait. Where was I going with this? I guess we don't really need the fall damage thing now. Because if we have the hat on, then we'll be resistant to fall damage. Or would we not be? Oh no, because this says 25. So yes, this would fix the problem. So we would, I think we would have exactly 100% resistance to fall damage. We would have three hearts. So um, the one from this and the two from this. So we would be resistant to fall damage. And we would still have the same amount of hearts we have now. And that's not including if we encrust them with a citrine, citrine, and that will give us an extra, if we encrust both of them, that will give us another full heart, and we will regen even more, which is, would be, would be lovely. And I think that would just be a good overall, like, caving around, falling, stuff like that. Be a really cool, just kind of like general, general armor setup. And I've also, I've heard this one before, um, so one of the biomes in Yuka is called an emerald biome, I guess, and I found this in a chest there, and it automatically regens a, um, like one, like one little tick of a heart every second, and, um, so the armor automatically has that, but if you add citrine, I think it adds, yeah, it adds another one, so it'd be really cool, because you would be like, I think you would be able to regen a little bit more than half a heart a second, which is crazy, which is super fast. So you would pretty much automatically regen your stuff, which would be cool. Um, but I would have to mine a lot to find all the pieces for that. But it would still be cool nonetheless. Um, before we go mining, actually, um, let's go ahead and grab a couple keys. Do we have anything unneeded on us doesn't look like it let's go ahead and grab a couple keys so if we do run into chests or anything like that we will have keys 
and let's just go ahead and grab some gold ones and uh oh we do have a mithril one let's grab a mithril one too and then i think we're good to go if i remember correctly when i have uh mined around and yuka there are quite a few mithril chests and i've never really found anything like good in them but uh it's still fun to open them because it's the wonder the cat gets the what i don't know the but I don't know what that saying is. Never mind. I'm going to stop talking. Uh, so while we get down here. Um, I actually don't know how deep this cave is. Huh. I don't know. Uh, but while we get down here. There have been lots and lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of problems. Actually have I gone down to bedrock? Hold on. Let's see. Alrighty. I have not gone down to bedrock. That is good. Um, but there have been lots and lots and lots and lots and lots, I have to do it again, of problems with world downloads. And I believe, ooh, I don't know what that is. Stop, stop, no, 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 <laughs> get out of here. Um, oh, this is like off. Okay, let's fix this. Uh, but there's been a lot of problems with world downloads. And I think it must have changed in the last update. And um, just like the way downloads they work differently now or something and um i was trying to help someone troubleshoot just because no 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 don't touch me <sighs> yeah take that oh my gosh get out of here let's just block this off um i was trying to help someone troubleshoot through twitter just to try and figure out what the issue is so i could help other people as well because so many people had been having the same issues and I had tried multiple things, but I just, like, I I wasn't running into the issue myself, so I didn't really know how to fix it. And then I tried installing a world through iFile, and that's where I ran into the issue. And I, I still don't understand, and I still don't know how to fix it. Um, the problem is, is that when you install the world, for some reason the game thinks that there is a, ooh, what is up there? Ooh, a mystery hell chest. Uh, but for some reason, the game thinks that there is a file missing or something when you install through uh, iFile. So I don't really know what to do. Oh, that broke really quickly. Um, it doesn't look like we got anything. That was disappointing. Um, but I still, so I still haven't figured out a way to fix it yet. Um, some people actually have problems. Um, with iPhone box and I'm assuming I explore as well. I just I I don't run into the issue So I don't really know how to fix them um, I tried on multiple devices. They all seem to work other than with iFile So I don't really know why all the files are there and I just I don't know why they're not working I've also noticed that and it must have changed with the last update unless I just didn't notice it until now that before you would have uh, each world would have a folder with all of the world info. So like for Terra or Yuka or anything like that, it would have all the data for that in there. But then there would also be two separate files that was a .dat file and a .dat .back file. But now all of a sudden there's a .dat file and a .back file. But then sometimes when I look, there's a .dat and a .dat .dat back file and it's just it's confusing and i don't know why things work so if you're having issues with installing world downloads and it crashes whenever you hit the pause menu or when you um what's another one when you try to go through a portal it crashes through there i'm trying to figure out currently i'm trying to figure out why it's doing that if it's my download or what so i We'll let you guys know if I find a solution for that. But for now, I guess I just can't really have world downloads. I'm assuming it works for some people because it works for me. And I don't know if maybe it has to do with your iOS because I do have a really out of date iOS right now. I think I'm still on like iOS 7.1 or something. So mine's pretty out of date. Uh, I don't know if maybe that has something to do with it, or maybe if you're on a, um, still on like iOS 6 or something, I don't really know. I don't know what to do about it. I just want to let you guys know though, because 
Uh, people have been messaging me constantly saying that it doesn't work and they don't know why. So we're in the same boat though. I don't know why it doesn't work either. Uh, if any of you guys know how to fix it or if you know why it's not working or maybe what file's missing, then please let me know. Um, but other than that, I, uh, yeah, I think that's it. Let's grab this real quick. I'm actually really good on gems. I have a lot of them. Let's just grab them real quick. Is there anything down there? I saw something jumping. I think it was, yeah, it's one of those large skulls. Uh, what, what are down here? Oh, more stuff. I don't know. Do I want to go off the path is the question. I don't know if I do. Uh, can you not kill me? Please? Please, can you not shoot little things at me? That would be lovely. Okay, I'm trying to fight more monsters because people always seem to complain that you always complain that uh, I always click out and click back in, which I've done a couple of times already. Um, but I just, I don't know. It's so much, okay, I'm just, I'm doing it again. It's so much faster and it makes it so that I don't die a bunch. Like, would you rather see me just dying a lot? Or would you rather just see me clicking on a mob for like 30 seconds trying to kill it? It's just, it's, it's faster. It's faster. It's easier. Let's grab this. I go through gold so much just because I make all my tools out of it. It's kind of annoying actually. Um, it looks like there's another chest down here. I actually tend, I don't know why I'm trying to kill you with a hammer. I actually tend to find more rares in um bronze locked chests for some reason then in mithril i've never found anything rare in a mithril chest to be honest actually let's put these back oh uh, doesn't look like we got anything is there anything around here it doesn't look like it let's go on back if i don't end up finding anything i might uh just click away click back i guess we're looking for portal pieces um, we're also trying to get to bedrock. I think I'm gonna make a, uh, a mob trap once we get to bedrock. From what I've heard, that is how you get a, um, what is it called? It's like a fancy fishing rod or something. It's a mob drop, apparently. I thought it was a rare thing that you got from a chest, but, um, people, people are saying it's from a mob drop. I'm not entirely sure, actually. I was trying to find out more information about fishing and stuff and apparently the way it works is the better the fishing rod the faster you get fish the uh, and then the bait slash hook is just it depends you I think it's you're more likely to find certain fish and I'm not really sure what those certain fish are like I don't think anyone else is either oh no don't die Woo! That was close. Um, for a mop trap, I'm not sure what uh, liquid I would be able to use. Since there is acid, I would assume that the mobs are acid resistant, but I'm not really sure. So I'd probably have to use water for it. Uh, I am gonna go real quick. If I run into any biome, biomes, biomes, or anything else i will come back all right yeah i've been digging down just a little bit further and we have now hit bedrock so i'm gonna go up a little bit more and i think i'm gonna try traveling straight out hello pat flinger you fling pots that's a really stupid power the fling pots how lame uh, but i think i'm gonna go up and then i'm gonna go like out this way maybe and then I will see if I can find a biome or anything fancy like that I'm not entirely sure if there are portals in Yuka I don't really know yet I really want to get the cryo though because um, the cyan shell chest piece that I was talking about earlier oh I like oh that was weird um the cyan chest piece that I was talking about though you have to get the oh primitive silk sweet um, you have to get the shells in cryo, so we need to get to there, but if you still need to get them in Zeno, then we need to get to Zeno before we get to cryo, so I don't really know. The whole portal 
thing kind of confuses me. <laughs> I feel like once they added Cryo and Yuka, it just wasn't very straightforward anymore. It's just kind of gotten confusing. Don't throw your red orbs at me. Stop it. Thank you. I haven't seemed to get any rare drop or anything. I've just gotten ivory bones. I'm pretty sure that's what they're called, right? Those ivory bones. Yeah. No. Stop. My gosh. I just want to get this green things and I want to keep looking around. Do we see a biome? No, we don't. I'm going to keep mining this way and if we run into a biome, then okay. Alrighty, I have been mining some more. I ran into like a small little cave system of just open caves, but there was nothing in them. And then I was mining along and I found this dirt. So I figured maybe it led to a biome and it does. Woo! So let's look through this biome. I've actually ran into one of these quite a few times. These are great if you need, um, ooh, our inventory is full. Let's clear it out real quick, actually. Um, these biomes are great if you need a lot of red dye. This is basically the only place you can get a mass amount of red dye, and it is fantastic. I really have a full inventory. I've already emptied it out quite a few times. Um, let's see here. We can get rid of the sticks. Look at my coal. I didn't even realize that till a couple minutes ago. I have 999 coal. Like, what happened? Um, let's just get rid of these dirts. Um, we can get rid of those and the arrows. Um, let's see here. That only leaves us with 9, 10, 11, I think. Oh, we can get rid of these. Um, okay. That will have to be good for now. I don't want to deal with those mobs. And I think, is it these? Yeah, our tool isn't strong enough. And they kind of just hang there on their own. But I think, is this strong enough? Yeah, see? The flowers just like burst with red petals and it's wonderful. Um, I think it's it's just the ones that chill on the walls. I'm not sure what other ones... What the other ones do? Um, I think this will be a good one because it's got a long stem. And I really like these bridges. I'm not really sure why, but I like them. Nope, nope, okay, petals. Even though it only gives you two petals, it's pretty much the only thing that's guaranteed to give you petals. Everything else is just kind of a waiting game. You have to wait for them to grow, blah, blah, blah. Can you not? I'm trying to record a video and you're ruining it. And I don't remember what these eggs drop. Yeah, I don't think it's anything too fancy. I think it's usually just bones. There might be a rare drop. I'm not really sure. These bridges are cool, even though I don't have anything to do with them. And these drop, what wood color is this? Light wood. And I think that's really the only other drop. These little tusk things drop um, more bones. Shocker. I feel like that's all Yuka does, is just drop ivory bones. And I think this is actually a different tree. There's two spiky trees. This one drops bark. This is a cave tree sapling. Cave tree. And is there anything else up here? Just one more flower. Dig that. I don't think that one actually dropped anything. Boo. Other than the sapling. Oops. No, come back. Come back to me. Where did they go? Did I not pick them up? Oh, they're right here. Perfect. Okay, so there was that biome. <laughs> and... That was it. This is actually a pretty small biome. It didn't really have much of anything. There's some gems up here. I really, I don't know. I like getting gems, but they're kind of annoying because in Yucca, they're everywhere. They are everywhere. So a lot of times I will just pass them up because I feel like I already have a bunch of them. Ooh, that was a good one. Um, I feel like I already have a bunch of gems, but I'm not really sure. Don't actually know how many gems I have. I only have like one amethyst gem which uncrusted or uncut uncut so i definitely need to get more of those even though i want to say is amethyst the stupid one where it just makes you glow a little bit or is that sapphire that might be sapphire i don't remember i always forget what each gem does let's see if this crate has anything good in it it has a key which is cool i guess um i've actually picked up two silver keys which is cool um, I'm actually going to get rid of these because I already have some and that and that and that and that and that. Get out of here. And I'll also get rid of 
I actually, I'll keep the corn seed because I only have one of those. Um, but yeah, I'll get rid of that. I usually just get rid of anything that I know I already have, which most of the stuff in here I already have. Can you not, please? My god, if you kill me, thank you. Thank you for dying, good sir. Pick up that torch. Uh, but I'm gonna keep- ooh, that looks like there might be a biome up here. I'm gonna keep mining, and, uh, once I get up to what looks like to be a biome, I will be back with you. Alrighty, I took a little bit of a detour and found this little empty cave down here. Let's see, is there- nope, there's literally nothing good in there. <laughs> I just saw mostly sticks and nails. Um, oh god. Ooh! Man, it always scares me because I know I don't have full fall resistance yet. Oh, when we're back down at bedrock. Um, but then I like land and I only take a couple hearts of damage. I actually haven't ran into too many of those guys. There's another pot flinger. Stupid pot flingers. Oh gosh. I hate them. They're so annoying. Okay, die. Oh, hello pot flinger. We meet again. We meet again. And of course you just drop an ivory bone. What else would you drop? Um... Uh, let's let's keep looking through here to me the caves are a little bit more interesting than the actual biomes even though I could possibly get a biome chest which would be really nice um, around here could be more interesting things like fancy chests possibly a portal chest which I could just be yammering on about this portal chest and there might not actually be any portal chests in here I don't really know I know there aren't any in cryo unless that changed in the last update but I don't even know. I don't, I don't even know. And it doesn't look like there was anything down here. So I'm going to go head back towards that biome. And I will be back. Alrighty, we have reached the biome. And right away, there's already titanium here. There is a golem in there, which hopefully... I got a golem head in cryo, I remember, in last season. And that's the hat that I wore uh, for my main armor. Um, so I'm wondering if all of the golems possibly have, um, drops for their head because that would be awesome. That would be really cool. And I'm curious to see what the other ones are for. If they are a thing. If they exist. Um, okay. Kill you. How about- Golems take forever to kill- oh, he died. <laughs> They really take a long time to kill, though. And they do a lot of damage. Can you die? Can you die? Maybe you guys take forever to die. Dang. Okay. Um, doesn't look like they dropped anything other than insect meat. And I'm pretty sure that was from the spider. Okay. Um, let's see here. Do I actually want to pick this stuff up? Because I know I have a bunch of it back at the home. Back at the house. Uh, let's try killing him from here. I just really want to see if I can get a golem head. That would be so cool. Um, let's see here. Nope, nothing. Um, I don't think I'm going to pick up any of this stuff. Just because I know I have a lot of it back at the house. And it is always good to have extras of stuff in case you need a lot of it. But since my inventory is so full, I'm just not going to take any of it. Unless I run into a biome chest. And I also need to keep in mind that I am- ooh, ooh! I also need to keep in mind that I am going to have to find my way back up to the surface slash the diagonal mine. So I'm probably going to have to leave soon so I can actually find my way back over there. Let's get over here. Get over here. Can you not? Uh, no. Oh god. Can you- there we go. Okay, is there anything over here? If not, I think I'm actually gonna head back over to the house and there is nothing. So, um, let's see here. Can we actually, can we see any hint of our staircase if we go all the way over here? Um, you can see something. You can see the straight mine that I took to get over here. Can you not? No. <laughs> Whenever, like, sometimes I'll, I'll, like, fight the mobs, but sometimes they're just really annoying, and I'm trying to do slash see something, and they just get in my way, and I don't like it. It's gonna be a sad day, though, 
when they eventually, because I'm assuming they want to eventually make it so you can't just click out and click back in and the mobs are mysteriously gone. But it's going to be a sad day when they actually fix that or get rid of that lovely feature. So it's, it's a very lovely feature. Can I kill you? I'm really curious because I'm assuming like pretty much every mob has some sort of... Oh no, I already have that. Ooh, we can make a uh, a uh, trinket, a doobly-doo. We haven't really made too many doobly-doos uh, this, this season around. Uh, but I think I am going to go. I'm going to try to get back to uh, Diagonamon. Which is somewhat close-ish, kind of. And then I will get back to you. Alrighty, on my way back over to our diagonal mine, I ran into this lovely trust. Let's see if we can get anything from- Ooh, we actually did. We actually did. Let's let's take a look. Um, We got a glasses 3D shirt, which is pretty cool. I've gotten a couple of these shirts before. Uh, I think I have the vintage coin shirt also. Is there one more? There might be one more that I also got. And these are kind of just like plain shirts with like graphic things on them. Um, but I think I'm going to go again. <laughs> just because I'm still kind of like in the same general area that I was in last time. I'm going to keep looking for a mine and I will be back. Alrighty guys, I ran into yet another chest. This time it's a biome chest. So I'm really excited for this one. We definitely need to clear out some of our inventory, though. Um, hopefully this is good. I don't really know. I think I only have 10 spots. And let's pop a key in there. And hopefully we get something. Ooh, it looks like we got pants. Are those pants? Ivory set legs. You get three luck with them. Okay, I will take it, though. And let's get our blocks back up here. I also saw some... What is this titanium right here? Oh, it's in like a little cave. Oh, there's another chest right there. Let's grab that chest too while we're at it. And let's grab this. And this water's kind of weird. Does this lead up anywhere? Do you go anywhere? It looks like it actually goes into another larger cave. I'm not going to go over there though just because I kind of want to get back over to the mine a lot. I've been digging for quite a while and I'm kind of done with it. Um, let's get rid of some stuff. Uh, let's see, can we pick everything up? Looks like we did. Didn't get anything. Okay, let's us head back over here. Again, not gonna grab anything through here. I know this is probably gonna piss off a lot of people that I'm just leaving everything. Um, but I think we're almost over there. So I'm gonna go. I'll probably be back up on the surface unless I run into more chests. Alrighty, we are right next to the mine, but I have found yet, oops, I have found yet another chest. So, let's see here. Let's grab these, because the gems, why not? I have seriously passed so many gems. They are everywhere in this place. Let's get rid of these, and we can get rid of these. This whole episode has basically just been me throwing away things. Get out of here, spider. I don't need you unless you feel like dropping primitive silk, which I don't think you did. He didn't. What a dick. Okay, uh, we opened that. Let's get some blocks so we can... Nope, nope, nope. Get out of here. Get out of here. Come on now. Thank you. And you didn't drop primitive silk. How rude. Okay, let's open this up. Uh, doesn't look like we got anything. We didn't. Okay, let's head back over to our mine. It's just... On the other side of these blocks, I think. I hope. Oh, uh, yeah. We can just drop down here. I think this might have... Is this the way we went down? I don't know. Um, oh, get rid of you. Uh, I'm going to go back up to the surface. And then uh, we will finish up the episode, I think. I'm not really sure. We might do a couple different things. Oh, my gosh. I went back up to the surface and I found a purple turtle. Can you give us a shell? Nope. Of course you didn't. Okay, let's go back through a portal. Finally, definitely need to make a service mob trap. I'm not really sure of really any of the mobs in Yuka yet. I don't know what mob things you can get. Um, let's actually look at... Not there. Uh, here. I believe there is a trinket that used um, the mob drop that we got. This one right here. Rib spine or ripper spine. Ripper spine trinket. So we can make this, I believe, 
I don't know if I want to make it though because I mean we're not gonna wear it so <laughs> should we even make it I think this is the only thing you can use with these spine things the ripper spine um what other one I was looking at possibly making this but again, it doesn't really make much sense that it's a summer necklace and then you're resistant to lava. Shouldn't it be water, maybe? Hmm, I don't know. Um, let's see here. I think this is going to be about it. I'm not really sure if this is a long episode or not, just because there are so many cuts. But uh, let's see here. Uh, yeah, so this is the other shirt, kind of similar to this one that I got. A vintage coin shirt. And let's see here. These pants... I don't think I actually have- yeah, I don't have anything in the Ivor set. At least I don't think I do. Uh, nope. Um, I got- let's see here. I got these and these three shirts as well as these pants and maybe these ones? I actually don't know where I got those. Um, I got those all from the, um, like the treasure chests or whatever in the summer biomes. So, I've been trying to figure out if I've gotten everything yet. I'm not really sure yet. This is, uh, these things are from the Easter update and these. Um, but I have all of these. I have a message in a bottle, a soccer, soccer ball, and a sand castle, as well as all this stuff. Got some shells and the wood rudder. Uh, but I don't know if there's anything that I'm missing. Uh, but let me know if you know of anything that I don't have yet because I definitely want to make sure that I get everything Before I can't anymore because I would kind of suck But I think that is going to be about it. Oh, and also let me know. Can you get portal pieces in Yuka? Can you is cryo in Yuka or do you still get cryo in Zeno as well as magmar? It's just oh, it's so good Ah, I'm just so confused. Okay, but that is going to be about it. Thank you for watching this week's episode. All right, later, like, swoo. Please like and subscribe and all that stuff. And check out. Goodbye.